Hello everyone, dear viewers, friends, whatever. Welcome back to another episode of Ark the Order. Uh, real quick, before we get into today's episode's topic and all that stuff, um, some stuff I just wanted to go over. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I learned a lot from the amount of extra time I had in the last episode. And even though I, I think, looking, looking on it, I definitely could have done things better with it. Like, um... I don't know, I think there's a few too many edits to it, but, you know, whatever. I think some parts of it work and some parts of it do not. But, uh, before I, uh, go too far into that, let's... What the hell is that? Let's get, let's get back to the matter at hand. Oh, boy. Um. To keep it a long story short, I think we've hit the stage with this Let's Play where, um... It's going to take longer than a, than a day or however long I'm playing between episodes in order to uh, really make noticeable progress on what we want to do. Um, that being said, this last this this episode and the one after it. Actually, no, 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 no. It would be this one. So, no, this episode is uh, probably going to be the one where I make some changes to, uh, the changes to the schedule. I will be doing a, uh, put, like, introducing a formal schedule. No, no, I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry, I got off track there. Next episode, the one after this one, so I was right the first time, um, we will be doing a formal schedule, and, uh, let's see, is anything cool over here? Um, uh, of, like, when I'm going to be uploading videos for this Let's Play. Because I think I need to take more time with each one, especially at this point in the game, just so that we can have more done and therefore more things to do and not have to worry about it. Because there have been quite a few episodes lately where it just felt like filler to me after the fact. I was like, man, I could have approached that so much better than I did. Anyway. Um... In, in simple terms, what I'm trying to say is I'm going to be taking longer between episodes for this Let's Play. Now, that doesn't mean you won't be getting videos. Um, I would still like to do at least something uh, every six, like, uh, six days a week. So, while it may be, uh, you may only get two to four episodes of the Let's Play, depending on what my final uh, schedule deciding factor is... Um, you will definitely be getting content. And I'm thinking at this point, I'm gonna start... Uh, ooh, what's this? Ooh, this is pretty. Oh-ho! A screenshot! Anyway. <laughs> right as the music kicks in. Right as the... Right as the epic music kicks in! But, yeah. Um, and like I said, I'm just flying around right now. We'll get to the actual topic of the episode soon. But I... I just... Just pay attention a little bit longer, please. Um... I wanted to start a new Let's Play because... Or not a new Let's Play. What am I talking about? Um, I wanted to start a new a new playlist. And I think I'm going to make it like... Arc Experiments, Tips and Tricks, that sort of thing. Because I really enjoyed the uh, overall feel of the last episode. Where it's like, we went out to test something. And it's like, you know... It just... I've got over... I think at this point I've got like 3,000 hours in this game. I think I know a thing or two, and I might be able to offer some uh, tips and tricks to help people out if they don't know what they're doing, or if they just want a refresher, you know? So I might start something like that, where we, like, lots of, where we have uh, shorter videos that go over one simple topic, and then I'll do this, where I now have more time to work on these longer episodes that are, like, anywhere from 30 to 45 minutes long, you know? It's, um... It just makes my life easier, especially as we get into a very busy time of the year in my personal life for me. Uh, and that's also, I think, going to be quite a bit of fun, because I actually really like those. I really like sharing little little tips and tricks that I've learned over the years playing this game. So, let me know what you guys think about that in the comments in this episode. And, uh, I mean, I, I, it's like, honestly, I'm probably going to need to do that regardless, but I still want to hear what your opinions are. You know, that's important. It's important when you're entertaining to hear what the people what the people have to say. Uh, and factor that into the decision-making process. So, yeah, there we go. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. And now, on to the matter at hand. So, 
I, at this point in this episode, what I would like to do... Oh, what? Excuse me! Sir! Uh-uh! Sir, it, it... It didn't have to go down like that, buddy. It really didn't. That one's on you. Man. What is it with the last, like, three videos where it's like, I'm in the middle of, like, talking and, and like, one of... And a creature comes and messes me up. <laughs> oh, boy. Anyway... Uh, I wanted to go fight the, um, what's he called? Uh, Me Megapithecus, there we go. I was about to say the monkey, and I'm like, he's not a monkey, he's an ape. So, yeah, I would have been an absolute, I would have been absolutely fucking wrong there. Oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> okay. Oh boy. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Oh. God damn it. Uh, oh god. No, 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 no. And I'm dead. <laughs> I'm so dead. Ow. Oh, just, just, thank you. What? I finally find a Giga. It not only kills me, but it's level 150. <sighs> well... Change of plans! Wow, that voice crack. Oh my god. Materials, there's a change in plans. Uh, that is a 150 Giga. Now, while I don't need to tame a Giga, what kind of an arc let's play would this be if I didn't do that when presented with the chance to do so? Like, what? what is this? Oh, oops. Yeah, you don't have your bag. Okay, well, then you're going without food for a bit, Cammy. <clears throat> uh, wow. That is the first time this entire playthrough I've seen one. That's why I that's why I panicked like that. I I just wow. I actually yeah, that was a little bit embarrassing. <laughs> I saw that and I uh, I freaked out. Um and uh, in you know and I misclicked and I pressed E and dismounted from my creature. <laughs> Oops. However, um. I will say, I, 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 that actually may strangely have worked to my advantage. Uh, because even though I panicked, why I didn't just send Cammy out again and fly away, I don't know. But, um, yeah, uh, if, if that Giga is still in the ravine, I might be able to trap him in there. And if that's, uh, and if that is the case, if we can trap him, I think we're gonna have some fun with this one. By the way, if you enjoy, if you find yourself enjoying the episode, go ahead, do me a solid. Hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications for more. Oh, what the hell was that? I heard something stepping. Oh, it's a Trodon. I gotta say, I hate running into them in the wild, but I love them tamed. I despise taming them. <laughs> I think their taming method is a little stupid. To be honest, but I mean it's an interesting one. It's it's unique. Yeah, there's my body bag in there. All right. Now, assuming he didn't find a way out, which he could have. I actually didn't see what gender it was. All I know is a. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's still there. It is definitely still there. All right. Okay. I do not want it getting out of there because it's in an actually advantageous spot. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna put Cami away, and I'm gonna take a calculated risk here. What I'm going to do, see here, and this is one of those things, it's like, I'd love to do a little short of, you know, you want to trap a Giga, but you don't have what we have here, which is the great uh, natural terrain or modded creatures, you know? Okay, we're going to throw out my Megalania, because I don't want to take extra fall damage. And if it comes this way, I'm, I'm, I think I can rest assured. I'll be all right. What the? What? Okay. We don't know how that one worked, but uh, we're not going to question it. Okay, so what we're going to do here is I brought these gates, right? Now, normally, uh, you can make a, uh, a pretty good giga trap with just, like, with just gates, you know. Okay, we're going to go ahead and do, uh, excuse me, do this.
Now, he shouldn't be able to get through that. I'm basically going to trap him in here. Like, I'm basically going to box him in on all sides. Uh, now, he can break that structure, but he'll have to aggro on it. And uh, to help ensure that he doesn't, and I... Well, actually, I don't think this will change anything in the slice. By the way, this river, fantastic place for silica pearls. Just remember that. Piranha, I swear, if you trip this, I'm going to be pissed. Like, if you proc that bear trap, I'm going to be so mad. I brought a spare, but I've only got the one. Okay, he's still down here. Man, if I had a tape jar, this would be so easy. Hmm. Yeah, there he is. Not bad looking either. Oh, it's a she. I mean, a little burnt or burnt red. Not my thing, but I like the colors. I like the yellow. Okay. And he's just, he's just standing there. Oh, there he goes. There she goes. Uh, all right. Okay. How are we going to do this? Okay, let's see. Can I maybe bait bait her into chasing me while I'm here? On the side of the wall? Uh, no. Bitch-ass fucking Diplo. Alright, I what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let her, let her, oh, but the Diplo's just gonna push her right back in and get it, oh, and dead. <laughs> okay, you got, you on me now? Yes, you are. Oh my, please don't. Ow! Oh my god, what? Nope. Fuck that. Ow, please, ma'am, ma'am, I'm sorry, ow, it hurts, ow, that bleed is serious business, <laughs> oh, she knows, she knows something's up, hmm, come here, come here, Uh, I don't know how you lost sight of me in the first place, ma'am. I, I literally went around the corner. I, oh, fuck. Okay, this is getting dangerous. Huh? Wait. Can she not fit through? Oh, there she is. Oh, fuck. Uh... It's like, yep, she can break it. It's gonna take her a while, but she can do it. But thankfully, that doesn't appear to necessarily be a problem. Although I think she also just clipped the bear trap. So, all the better for me. Now, looking at this situation, I don't know how quite how long we've got before she uh, actually starts doing her thing. We're gonna switch to my other Megalania. Before she breaks out of that. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna switch to Little Green. I think he still has a saddle. He does not! Absolutely fantastic. Okay. We're gonna take this... Game. Why? <laughs> Oops, that's the wrong thing. Yeah, you are hurting, man. Good job, though. Yeah, we're going to throw out a little green here. Haven't used him in a while. The original uh, taming assistant. You get a little bit more health. That is not going to matter in like 10 seconds. Like, honestly. I would be... I shall be quite impressed. Uh, I might end up actually biting the bullet here again. And if that's the case, that's probably rip little green. But I will take a death as many times as I have to. Okay, I don't like the fact that she is facing me. 
It's not what we want. But she cannot hit me. Okay. Okay. Hmm. I think I know what I need to do. I've got a different tra uh, a different idea in mind here. See? Some of these things you do best on the fly, you know? Hey. I hear you stomping around down there. What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to set this up like a little barrier. Because what I'm going to try and do is bait her. Is uh, try and... Um, well, that idea might not actually work. We'll see. I'll give it a shot. Let's try and box her in as much as we can. Yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to break these out. Move forward. Oh, fuck me. Uh-oh. What the hell? Man, this swimming animation is whack. Okay, theoretically, she can't get through that. But even if she can, it don't matter. Now, I'm absolutely not going to send a Megalania in there to do this job. That is that is what we call a dead Megalania. <laughs> in no uncertain terms, that is that is a bad job. What we do have, however, is remember the winner of our previous episode's contest? Now, this guy has an advantage in that he can shoot his Taming Blast from range. So... What I'm going to try and do is try and uh, be a dick and um, snipe the Giga from on top of the ledge. <laughs> Alright, let's get on with it. Again, this is the first time I've even seen one and it's a max level. And I gotta tell you, that's both a bad and a good thing. Like, you know, I'm happy that we found one and I'm glad that we get to tame one. But damn it, I wish it had been, like, a lower level, because I need Giga Hearts. Yeah! Take that! Oh. Shit. Here, we're just gonna pump some oxygen here. Uh-oh. Okay, she's, uh... Gonna go ahead and get stuck on the thing there. Oh, come on. That's bullshit. There we go. Headshot! And I'm just gonna let the torpor completely build up every time. So this is gonna be kind of a long, slow burn here. I'm gonna keep all the footage in, but I may do some fast-forwarding.
Boom! Now, she did take splash damage there, so probably not 100% taming effectiveness. But that's honestly okay. It's a giga. <laughs> now, what isn't okay in this situation is see her torpor already dropping? Yeah. Gonna have to do something about that and quickly. So. Always good that we bring the boy with us. Now, is that going to be enough Narco Berries? We're going to find out. My gut says probably not, but it's all right. I'm just going to go ahead and feed that and just let him, let him, uh, see, see the kind of torpor and HP we're talking about here? Like, these things are just... <sighs> now, if only they stayed that way when you tame them. They get nerfed so hard, and it's unfair, in my opinion. Like, I get it. This is far too powerful of a creature to bother with ordinarily, but, like, you know, you obviously could not have players with tame versions of this at full power outside of mods. It just would be not a thing. Like, not a good thing at all. But that's hardly to say that, you know, it'd be bad. Actually, wait, do I have blood packs on me? If not, I can go get some real quick and make some of the... Yeah, I don't have any. Okay. All right, here's what we're going to do. Bring this guy in. Should be able to get her with this. Am I? I can't tell. I don't see any evidence of that. But, uh, you know. Yeah, and I think while she's doing that, I'm going to go actually harvest more Narco Berries. I don't think we got enough. <laughs> really should have brought my, uh, like, my biotoxin and such, but I didn't think to do that. I'm like, oh, we gotta get out there. I didn't even have a saddle for this thing. Damn. Man, so prepared. You just get a sheer size, uh, you know, I think it goes without- Oh, never mind! We will get full taming effectiveness, or as much as the game will allow. You know, 99.6, you don't lose any levels for that, so that's good. Excellent indeed, yes, yes. Oh. Derp! Here, you can have, uh, more of that. Like the Cryolophosaurus, the, uh... Kraken's Better Dino's Packy also relies on its oxygen stat, and I think maybe its stamina as well. I'd have to double check that. Um, uh, for its special abilities. At least I believe so. I need to double check it, but we'll do that later. Right now, we're taming Gigas, baby. Took however many episodes is this? What are we up to? 83 before we finally got one? <sighs> Was it worth the wait? We shall see. Stand by, I'm hitting up Dodo Dex real quick. Just so I can be sure. Because I want to see what stats we get before we get them, you know? Just in case. I mean, Grant, again, it's a Giga. Even nerfed, still incredibly powerful. Still so, so powerful. Oh ho! I mean, actually, there's a way to change the setting here. Hmm. No, there is not. Usually there is. I mean, for the purposes of this, it doesn't affect us at all. Like, for the purposes of this tame, it does not matter. Like, okay, yep, you're gonna get full thing. Okay, the only stat I care about.
Okay, so from what I've just gathered, very average Giga. You know, nothing too special. Decent, decent health, literally exactly the same base health as... Oh, there she is. Hey, there we go. I uh, need, again, definitely gonna need a name for this, uh, but right now... <sighs> America's ass, you have done your duty for queen and country once again. <laughs> Thank you for that. Actually, a lot of creatures did. Hell, I... Man. That went a lot smoother than I was expecting it to go. I mean, wow. Ugh. Oh, wow. Yeah, not bad on that melee after tame, post tame. So, definitely, definitely a worthy addition to the army. Alright. So, here's what we're going to do. Unfortunately, all my structures here have taken damage. So, I'm going to have to repair them. Um, cut away, and I'll bring us back to base. And then we're going to take this thing for a spin. And then we're going to call it an episode. Next episode, we will be... I will be doing, hopefully, a formal schedule if I have it figured out. Uh, I should at least have a rough idea. And then from there, we're going to go fight the um, Megapithecus once, perhaps twice. Uh, both Gamma and Alpha. Uh, I should be able to handle that. So, yeah. I'm looking forward to that. I hope you guys are too. And I will see you in a sec. Y'all ready for this? Because I sure am. <clears throat> um, yeah, now that I'm sitting on her, yeah, she does have really good colors. Yeah, obviously, real-life Giga, not even close to this size. This is obscene. <laughs> this is, like, borderline kaiju size, which is interesting because there is actual kaiju in Ark lore. Anyway, um, yeah, let's get right to it. Control. Uh, sorry, not control. What is it? Is it right-click? Why are you telling me admin mode is enabled? I don't even have this out. Oh. Yeah, admin mode now disabled. Put this away, please. Thank you. Okay. Right click again. Quite an impressive roar, honestly. Yeah, uh, Kraken's Better Dinos doesn't really do anything to this. I did check. Uh, and you can see there, there's no buff on the top of the top right screen, so. Not affected by the mod. I don't know if it ever will be. There is a Tech Giga, which Kraken's Better Dinos adds to the game, that has a 5% chance of replacing any uh, any Giga spawn, but I'm not sure if that's uh, Genesis 2 exclusive or not. Or Genesis Part 1 exclusive. I would have to double-check that. Um, we got some Hyenodons here. Um, this very basic dinosaur from the age of basic bitch dinosaurs... But what it does, it does very well. And what does the Giga do? I mean, it goes without saying. Gigas kill things. You can see I'm hitting for a very solid 300 damage, which to start off is, as a base, far more... Actually, that's about the same amount she was hitting me on my Megalania. So let's see what she hits for without the Stego's resi damage resist. Or the Anki. Is, is there anything here I can kill, please? That isn't going to resist my damage. Holy! That's base. That is base wild tamed damage. Also, Giga's obviously sh crap stamina. Absolute garbage. Um, it's important to be careful with your Giga when dealing with creatures that do recoil damage. As you can see, very... Let's see if I can get it into frame here. Uh, if you'll notice, very faintly on the right side corner of the screen, there's a heart similar to the acro. Uh, it has a rage meter, sort of like the acro, except it will boot you off and start attacking everything in sight, so you always want to be careful. I think they did nerf it a while back so that it won't uh, rage quite so easily as it used to, so you have to worry about it less. But, uh, actually, I'm not taking recoil at all from them. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, I hit without any levels into melee. And, um, you know, other people have mentioned this in their own videos, but with a Giga... What the... Sir? What the... 
Oh, you can't handle me, Trodon. Get out of here. Ooh. Can I kill that man? I don't know. What level is it? And you could just see why it is that they have to nerf this creature. But the sad story here. Remember that 80,000 HP gets nerfed to this. And you don't ever want to bother. And now 15,000 is not bad. By It's very respectable amount of HP uh, for a wild tame creature. But, <clears throat> you know, um... Uh, the, the, the one that really, I think, took the hardest hit is Stamina. This is this is just a, a an absolute sad story right here, that, that Stamina. But, um, yeah, really, these things, you really only care about melee. That's it. The, in my opinion, biggest example of a creature where all stats save one just don't matter. And the only reason why is, like, yeah, you can level health if you want to. Um, there's no reason why you can't, and it's still a net positive, but you're wasting a level up point because, uh, you only get, you get, I'm not gonna do it, because I don't want to do it. Um, you you get only a tiny amount of health per, like, it's not worth it. You're far better off just leveling melee. <laughs> what level is this thing? I don't want to just engage it recklessly. Oh, oh, you're dead. You're dead. While Gigas have a bleed effect, I don't believe the, uh, no, I, I don't think they, no, captive ones don't either. Captive ones do not have a bleed effect, but wild ones do, which I think is ridiculous. Yeah. You were just backing it up, boys. <laughs> and you're dead. I just hit them, I just hit that those ants so hard that they fell into another dimension. That's how powerful the Giga is, it's bite warp space and time! You don't need any special abilities, man. When you're dishing out damage like that, that's all the special you need. Love the colors on this thing. Man, I sure hope another one spawns before too long. Um, I, I did know that they spawn in that general area. I've been looking for them there. I've been looking for them on the volcano island. I've been looking for them everywhere that I've that I know that they spawn, and I have not seen one until this one. And that's however many episodes, however many hours playing the game, on and off camera. I have not seen one. So I'm not as much as I need Giga Hearts. I'm not passing up a max level when they don't only spawn so often. So, and also that does answer the question, do they, are, is there a spawn issue with them? No. The real problem is single player. The... Did you guys see that? Oh. Ah, you got killed by a on. you suck. Get wrecked. <laughs> Yeah, if ever there was a creature in vanilla that can best the do the Domination Rex, it is this thing. In terms of raw damage output? Oh, yeah. Now, overall, I would say the Domination Rex is probably better. Because the Domination Rex does not have a... Uh, does not have absolutely shit health uh, gains per level, but... You know, it is what it is. But yeah, I think we're just gonna murder this miss this whole field and call it an episode. Uh, they that ought to do it. What you call what you call excessive force, I call uh, renewal, so that it can be re so that new new life may take its place and thus achieve its full potential. <clears throat> Anyway, that is definitely going to do it for today's episode. Once more, if you enjoyed it, please hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications for even more. Um, yeah, finally got a Giga. I, I wish it was a lower level so that I could have gotten its heart, but it is what it is. I really shouldn't be complaining. I, I'm, no, nope, nope, I'm going to shut up. Nope, this has been TVT signing out, and I will see you guys in the next one. 
बाय